हेलो एस्पायरिंग आर्किटेक्ट्स वेलकम टू स्केट स्कूल ऑफ आर्ट एंड क्रिएटिविटी आज के वीडियो में हम डिस्कस करेंगे डिफरेंट वेज टू बिकम एन आर्किटेक्ट इन इंडिया आफ्टर कंप्लीटिंग टेंथ और ट्वेल्थ ग्रेड अब वेदर यू प्लानिंग ऑन बिकमिंग एन आर्किटेक्ट और यू कम्प्लीटली डिसाइडेड दिस इज अ मस्ट वॉच वीडियो फॉर यू बिकॉज इफ यू वॉन्ट टू बिकम एन आर्किटेक्ट यू विल ऑब्वियसली हैव टू नो अबाउट द वेज यू कैन डू सो and this video would be a road map to kick start your architectural journey many students only know few ways due to which they always remain confused that what might be the best option for them so in today's video i will tell you all the possible ways through which you can become an architect in india so without much introduction let's get started Starting with a very basic question, who is an architect? An architect is a professional who designs and plans buildings, structures, and spaces, ensuring that they are safe, functional, and aesthetically pleasing. Meaning that an architect should have all of these qualities like creativity, communication skills, project management, designing skills, and so on. There are some students who are confused with what. paths to choose after 10th after 12th with bachelor degree without bachelor degree with diploma and so on so we are going to see each of these paths in detail so that you can decide for yourself which path you need to choose now becoming an architect in india is a very exciting journey that involves specific educational qualifications and steps so that can either be achieved with bachelor degree or without bachelor degree also so let us start with the first way to become an architect in india after completing the 10th class this is the most common way most students do opt for after your 10th class you will have to opt for science complete your 12th class then give nata or je bhg examination that is entrance preparation after which you'll have to do 5 years of bhg degree after completing your bhg degree you'll have to do coa registration which is council of architecture there are certain documents which you need to submit for registration process after which you can begin a professional career as a licensed architect talking about alternative ways there are some other ways to become an architect in india after completing your 10th class the alternative architecture courses after 10th are diploma in architectural engineering diploma in architectural assistantship construction management construction technology architectural draftsman foundation diploma in architecture and design so all of these diploma courses range from 1 to 3 years of time after completing your diploma what next you can either prepare for your entrance examination and continue pursuing bhg degree of 5 years and then register yourself in coa to work as a licensed architect so this would be an alternative method to become an architect there are some alternative courses also through which you can become architect after 12th class so you will have to do btech or b plan which would be of 4 years after which you can continue with mrg degree that is masters in architecture of 2 years complete your registration with coa but in this case you won't get any license to work as a architect but you will be able to apply for government jobs and even in private companies there are more ways to become an architect without bachelor degree in this case no bachelor degree will be required but you will also get license over here if we talk about after 10th class after 10th you'll have to do diploma in architectural assistantship interior design or civil engineering if you do any one of these diploma after that you'll have to register yourself in iia that is indian institute of architects we'll talk more about iia in the coming slides but for now you need to understand that you'll have to register in iia after which you'll have to do your coa registration through which you can become a licensed architect and begin your professional career now if you want to become an architect after 12th class without a bachelor degree you will have to do your 12th in science after which be civil 
or B.Tech Civil or Interior Design courses of four years. After pursuing your degree, again you'll have to register in IA, that is Indian Institute of Architects. Complete your COA registration to become a licensed architect and to begin your professional career as well. So this would be an alternative method talking about documents to be submitted for registration as an architect. So the first one is application form which has to be a color printout. Second is a copy of date of birth certificate which can also be self-attested. Third is a self-attested copy of mark sheet of 10 plus 2 e or equivalent examination. Fourth is a self-attested copy of final recognized architectural qualification certificate. And the last one is self-attested copies of mark sheets. It has to be all of your mark sheets, including practical training as well, meaning your internship. Now let's talk about IIA, that is Indian Institute of Architects. The Indian Institute of Architects is the national body of architects in the country. This was established around 1917 and the institute today has more than 27,000 members across the country. Now what is the eligibility criteria for registering yourself? Educational qualification will include diploma holders, three years full-time diploma approved by the state government with minimum of 50% marks. Now, the diploma could be in architectural assistantship, interior design or civil engineering. After completing your diploma, you will have to have architectural experience under the employer architect. The employer architect means any registered architect who is a member of IIA and has to have five years of professional experience. In case the diploma is acquired after 10th standard, then your working experience should be in architectural assistantship two years, interior design two years and civil engineering three years. But if your diploma is acquired after 12th standard, then your working experience will be less, meaning in architectural assistantship one year, interior design one year, civil engineering two years. There is one other thing which is required that is NATA qualification. In that you need to have 70 marks out of 200 marks. So this would be your eligibility criteria for registering yourself in IIA. The last question is, can you become an architect without a degree in India? Supreme Court has mentioned under Section 37 of the Architects Act 1972 does not prohibit individuals not registered under the Architects Act from undertaking the practice of architecture. This simply means that as per Supreme Court of India, you can practice designing and construction without any degree. However, you cannot use the title architect without a degree and without registration. Also guys, being an architect, I want to tell you something that if you really want to become a successful architect, good education will play a key role in that. Abhi se tum jitni zyada mehnat karke, achche se achche college se apna education complete karo, aage chalke tumhe utna hi zyada fayda milega. At SSAC, we have been preparing hundreds of students over the past few years for NATA and JEBH examination and last year our results broke all records. One third of our students became toppers in the JEBH examination and one fourth of our students were toppers in the NATA examination. One third and one fourth mein aana koi mushkil nahi hai. If you have the dedication and you're willing to work hard, no one can stop you from getting into top colleges. Engineering ya medical jitna competition to nahi hai, but the only thing is that correct guidance becomes really important. So first, it's important for you to have a clarity in your mind so that you know in what way you can start your preparation. It's really difficult to completely explain in a single video what will be the correct way. So I would like to recommend you to book a free demo class with us. It's completely free of cost and even if you don't want to join, no questions would be asked. Sab log aate hai, questions poochte hai, doubts poochte hai, interact karte hai. So why you being lazy, you can call or WhatsApp us on this number visible on the screen to book a free demo class. Or you can also directly book it from our website. 
link is in the description and there you have it the steps to become an architect in india after 10th or 12th grade so i hope you guys like the video and please don't forget to hit the like button because ye videos banane mein kafi mehnat lagti hai and uh, when you guys like the video obviously it gives a lot of motivation also to us so see you in classes now and let's meet in the next video bye bye